Hello guys, welcome once again. In this video, I will show you how to use images and icons with your Visual Basic Windows Form application. So suppose I have a situation so that I have this login form and I want to set a nice looking picture which suits my login form uh, in my project. So how can I do that? Or I have a situation that I want to show uh, icon on this button so all this I will show you in this video so let's set a picture on uh, this form first so go to the toolbox and there is a tool called picture box in your uh, visual basic toolbox you can resize it just drag and drop and resize and when you click this small arrow button you will be able to see the size mode and the dock in parent, parent container and choose image so first of all we will choose our image and I will choose our image from local resource so I will just select this radio button and import an image and I will simply import a, a image here and I will click OK so you can see uh, our image is set in your picture box but when I stretch uh, my picture box you see that the image is not totally fitting to the picture box so how to fix it once again uh, there are two ways you can go to this arrow button uh, once again and you can choose the size mode from here so there are some size mode so for example there is auto size which makes a picture bigger or according to the size of the picture your picture box will be sized but if your picture is bigger and your uh, picture box is smaller I will suggest you to use stretch image so that it the picture will be adjusted according to the picture box size oh okay or you can use uh, this uh, zoom also to stretch your uh, or stretch or uh, size or image according to the picture box but the best is stretch image okay so now this is done now I will show you how to set an icon on this button so first of all uh, let me show you how you can get icons and other things from internet it's very easy and free so just go to your browser and uh, say free icons okay and the first option that you will see here or there are some uh, options available which provides free icon online but generally I go to a site called icon archive which is a large amount of icon you can find here and I go inside it and I can I will find according to my need so for example I need a OK icon so here you can find all the icon related to OK and the other thing is the size of the icon so my button is uh, sized and I, uh, a little button and I want to uh, I want to have a icon which is sized as my login button so I can choose my icon size from here so go to this size and for example generally a small button takes 16 by 16 px or you can choose this 24 by 24 px also and when you choose it it will give you bigger image option and then I will go to the first option PNG image and I will right click and save as and I will save my this image in my desired location once you have done that just select your uh, login button and go to search for uh, 
the image property here so select the button and go to the image property this is image property and click the small button and now this is the same way we have imported the earlier image I will choose my OK icon image and click OK and you see here your icon is placed into the login button but you also see that it's placed uh, uh, in the middle and your login uh, text is also in the middle so how you can resolve that so that icon will be uh, on the left side and the login text will be on the right side so just choose the icon align property from here and you can choose the alignment of the icon so I choose the left middle and now your icon is on the left middle okay and once again I will go to the button properties and now I will go to the text align from here and I can choose the text alignment from here also so for example middle right okay and now you can resize your button and it will look good now so in this way you can change the property and you can set the icons on the buttons and you can set the image with your Visual Basic Windows Form application. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment and subscribe and bye for now.